What is up bros and bro, it's Zing Slasher 44 and today we're going to be talking about the best guns in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and this is a very interesting topic because the game is so new and so fresh but I think I already have a pretty good grasp of the three guns that are going to kind of reign supreme in this game and uh, we're going to talk about those but first I'd just like to quickly say all three of these guns are assault rifles and Advanced Warfare currently is a very very strongly weighted towards assault rifles. Um, I don't know why, considering the maps are so, so small, but overall, it's so strongly based on assault rifles, just because I think the SMGs don't have enough range, and then, like I said, the maps are so small that the next best thing is the assault rifles, because they have the more range, but they're still automatic kind of thing. So that's kind of my thoughts on it, but the first gun I'd like to talk about is the BAL-27. So the BAL-27 is a really, really good assault rifle. It's the very first assault rifle that you have, and uh, it doesn't really play like an assault rifle it plays more like an smg it has a really high fire rate not the most damage but pretty good damage and if you play this gun like you'd play an smg in any other call of duty game whether it be call of duty ghost call of duty black ops if you play it like that you will do very 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 well with the bow 27 and once you get used to its kind of recoil kick up kind of thing you will do even better even with those long range gunfights after that we have the imr the imr is a very interesting gun so that is the 3d printer gun as everyone was calling it it is a four burst gun that bullets are printed back into the gun so it's a very very cool gun and it actually does some pretty heavy work so it has very very good damage i think it's like 18 damage you'll see up on your screen here and it has also very very good range and because of this is a very very strong gun if you keep your distance and you keep in the right distance not too far not too close you will do very very well with this gun it kills very quickly i think it kills quicker than any other gun don't quote me on that but as far as my opinion goes it kills probably the quickest out of any gun in the game and it could be a contender for the best gun in the game especially once you get used to it uh, i like having a red dot sight on it but once you get used to its recoil it's very 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 strong and kills very quickly and then the gun that i think most people are saying is the best gun in the game is the hbr a3 now this gun is very very good and there is a variation of this gun that's even better but we're going to talk about that later this week uh different variations of guns we're going to talk about that because i have uh three of them i'd really like to hint on uh, but that's for later this week. So the HBR A3 is a very, very good gun. Does a lot of damage, has a very good range, and its recoil is almost not even there. Other than the AK-12, I think this gun has the best recoil in the game. And because it has such a good damage, and because it has such a good range, right now I think everyone's considering it the best gun in the game. But I really do think the IMR gives it a run for its money, just because not as many people have unlocked the gun, because it's a later gun in the game. But yes, those are the three guns. So we've got the BAL-27, HBRA-3, and the IMR. I think if you stick to those three guns, you'll do very, very good in Advanced Warfare. But hey, that's just my opinion. Let me know what guns you're using in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like rating, share it with your friends if they think it's useful. And until next time, guys, Peace out.